This is the Daily Pulse from Speak My Word Ministries of Travis Zimmerman. And the message today is that salvation is available to all. Amen. Through Jesus Christ and Jesus Christ alone. And I take you to the book of Luke here. And this is on the eighth day. When Jesus is born, the eighth day after his birth, he's presented into the temple. And there are actually two people that we'll read of in scripture who Jesus' parents will meet. And Jesus, of course, will meet as well. One is named Simeon and one is named Anna. And I want to go specifically into Simeon, and again, as proof that salvation is available to all. This is Luke chapter 1, verses 25 to 32. Luke chapter 1, verses 25 to 32. Now there was a man in Jerusalem called Simeon, who was righteous and devout. He was waiting for the consolation of Israel, and the Holy Spirit was upon him. It had been revealed to him by the Holy Spirit that he would not die before he had seen the Lord's Christ. Moved by the Spirit, he went into the temple courts. When the parents brought the child, in the, the child Jesus to do for him what the custom of the law required, Simeon took him in his arms and praised God, saying this, Sovereign Lord, as you have promised, you now dismiss your servant in peace. For my eyes have seen your salvation which you have prepared in sight of all people, a light for revelation to the Gentiles and for glory to your people Israel. Wow. Genesis, Luke chapter 1, verses 25 to 32. For the, my eyes have seen your salvation, which have been prepared for the sight of all people, a light for the Gentiles and for the people of Israel. So Jesus truly was the king of the Jews. He did come to save the Jews. But he had sheep in other, he had sheep in other, another pen, Luke chapter ten, other flock. That's the Gentiles. That's us, those who aren't Jews. So salvation is available to each one of us. It's not something that you have to go fight for, or something you can earn, or something you can pay enough money to get. And, 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 and none of that, none of that matters. All that matters is Jesus Christ and His saving love and His saving grace. Trust Jesus with your life. Trust in Him. That salvation is available to you. And all you need to do is confess your sins and confess that Jesus is the King and your Savior. Amen.